Hey beautiful people, welcome back to the Toast Kitchen. Okay guys, before we get into the main thing, let me welcome our new subscribers. Thank you guys for subscribing. High five to you all. So to my day one subscribers, mm, I blow kisses to you guys. Thank you for believing in me. Okay guys, let's get into the business. So today I'm going to be making white rice with my sauce. I'm going to show you the process. Everything is ready. So as I'm putting it into the pot, I'm going to be telling you what I am doing. Okay. So let's start. Okay guys, so I've had this chicken uh, in the pot for over 30 minutes. I season it, I allow it because I just want it, uh, the season to just soak into the chicken, okay? So it's actually ready to start cooking. Okay guys, so the chicken is almost ready. As you can see, that's the benefit you get when you allow your chicken, uh, when you season it, I allow it for some time okay guys so i'm using two types of cooking oil for this sauce so i'm using the palm oil and at the same time i'm using olive oil okay so i'm gonna mix the two together i cover it and allow it to uh, bleach a little bit okay before adding any other thing into it okay guys so our cooking oil is ready so i'm adding my onions I'm going to saute it and at the same time I'm going to add my no cube, my no chicken. So I'm going to use it as my seasoning and I give it a good mix. So I'm also going to be adding my tomato and pepper. I blended it together. So I have the tomato, I have the pepper, I have uh, garlic, I have ginger. All together I blended them together. So I'm going to add it and i miss it give it a good means guys at uh, this process you have to be a little bit patient you have to allow it to at least cook up to seven minutes okay guys so our chicken is ready so um what i did i grilled the chicken that's what i did you see so i didn't want to fry it i didn't want to use oil to fry it, so i just grilled it so it's actually looking nice it's good and it tastes super good Okay guys, so um, our sauce is actually ready. Mm, yeah, guys, I, allow, I actually allow this for up to 10 minutes, okay? So here I'm adding my crayfish and at the same time adding my sauce. I'm adding my all-purpose seasoning, okay? So guys, mm, I give it a good mix. At the same time, I'm adding my uh, chicken stock. I'm adding it to it. I mix it and I cover it for another two minutes. So guys, the sauce is ready. So now I'm gonna be adding our grilled chicken into the sauce. So, and at the same time, I boiled egg. I'm gonna be adding the boiled egg, okay? So if you have scent leaf, you can add it. It's optional, it's up to you. But if you don't, I mean, this is actually perfect. So that is it and our sauce is ready. Okay guys, so get another clean pot. Add your cooking oil. You can use any oil of your choice, but I'm actually using olive oil today. So add just a little, add your onions, saute it. At the same time, I'm adding my garlic and ginger blended together. I give it a good mix. I also added my chopped bell pepper, green bell pepper. I chopped it very tiny, so I mix it together. So guys, here, this is the secret of this food if you can get this right you're good so at the same time i'm gonna be adding my seasoning i have my i'm still using my no cube that is the chicken seasoning i'm still using it i give it a good means okay guys so our rice is ready so i'm gonna add it i wash it very well and i drain the water so i add it and give it a good means so guys at the same time i have these two types of beans i'm gonna be using i have the red kidney beans the small size of it and i also have the uh, black eye beans so i'm gonna start with the red kidney beans i'm gonna add it and give it a good mix i mix it together so I add my black eye beans, I mix it together. Guys, make sure you marry them, like good mixing, okay? So I add a little salt to it, be careful with your salt. So guys, I'm using my coconut milk. So 
So I'm going to use coconut milk. Make sure you have enough. But if you don't have enough, you can be topping it with little water. But this, I have enough coconut milk for this. I add it up. I give it a good mix. I'm going to cover it and allow it to cook for five minutes. Okay, guys. So our rice is actually ready. Did you see how it feels? It's actually one one. It didn't stick to each other. So this is how it's supposed to be. I mean, that is the beauty of what we are cooking today. Making sure that the rice doesn't stick to each other. Okay, guys. So I'm gonna be dishing it out. Also dishing out the stew. Yeah, we're almost ready to eat. So guys, if you have not subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. I don't really know what you're waiting for. I don't know why you haven't subscribed to my channel. Okay, so let me dish out. Mm, guys, look at this. This is actually good. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for leaving your comments. Thank you for liking and thank you for sharing. I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Bye.